Hi, I'm Gary White for Central Kentucky Television. I'm here with Stacey Mattingly, who is the Executive Director for the Marion County Chamber of Commerce, who puts on ham days every year. We do. Yes, we do. It's that time of year. Exactly. It's coming up, and it's going. It's only six weeks away or seven weeks away or so, right? I believe so, Gary. The last time I looked at the calendar, we were right about 35 days or something like that. <laughs> so, yeah, give or take a few. Yeah. yeah. Wow, it's coming up. And it's going to be September 28th and 29th in Lebanon that weekend. Of course, there are events all week leading up to the activities too, right? Absolutely. We've got, you know, the ham judge contest. And I was actually just on Facebook and I noticed that, you know, a lot of our 4-Hers have got the hams going down to the state fair this week. And yeah. those hams will be coming back for ham days to be judged as well so we'll have that that Monday we have the pig pen relay that week and the ham biscuit contest that week and um, the swan and dines that week so I mean it is a full week of activities and then of course you know on Friday uh, the Battle of the Bands Mike FM does a fantastic mm -hmm. job of putting on Battle of the Bands that happens right up here on Johnston Field at Center Square and um, that is a free event so the, it, it's a party all week long that's right yeah and that kicks it off because Friday night we have those activities then on Saturday you have a full day of stuff going on, right? We do. It starts bright and early Saturday morning. Of course, the breakfast starts at 7 on Saturday, and uh, that is served up nice and warm in the uh, Dunn Chrysler breakfast tent. So we, you know, we appreciate our sponsors, of course. And, and then, of course, we have the Farmers National Bank Pokey Pig. You know, last year they had a record number of runners, so we're hoping that we break that record again. We've got great shirts this year. You can register all these events, you know, that I talk about, you can register for all of them at hamdays.com. Very simple, and you can pay online, you can print off the applications and bring them to us. It's whatever, you know, is convenient. We try to make it as easy as possible. We know everybody's busy. <laughs> so on Saturday, like I said, the uh, Farmers National Bank Pokey Pig, and then we have the Springview Hospital P Pegasus Parade, uh, which is, you know, going to include a couple celebrities this year. We've got Turtle Man that's going to be making an appearance in the parade, as well as Tim from the show Moonshiners. He's going to be in the parade, and then I think he'll be hanging out at Limestone Branch Distillery all weekend long so if you can't catch the parade you can at least stop in out there and take a tour and meet Tim so okay. Fantastic. yes Saturday is full you know we um, on that Saturday afternoon after the parade we're doing a uh, we'll have an Elvis impersonator uh, okay. and we'll be doing a karaoke contest from four to eight so all of that will be okay. happening at the same time so if you've always wanted to sing in ham days right now is your opportunity so come on out right. and there'll be a cash prize and lots of fun on Saturday so what song are you getting prepared? You know what? I haven't decided yet. I'm kind of leaning towards the Dixie Chicks. You know, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> you have to come on out and see what Stacy performs up on the stage. Oh, right? yeah, <laughs> sure. <laughs> so, but again, on Saturday night, in the past, there's been bands and some other activities down on the stage. But this year, you're kind of trying to get people to go around to the restaurants in the community and that kind of ties in with the theme right yes it does uh, our theme this year is social networking since 1969 hashtag ham days and you know to a lot of the older generation not many people are going to understand that but if you think about it ham days is about social networking we've been socializing for several years now and so we thought we would tie that in with the more modernized uh, hashtag symbol and we are going to encourage our tourists that are here and you know our residents alike to go on and have dinner that night at your local restaurants. They'll have entertainment as well. So we're trying to encourage everyone to get out and just support the community as a whole. Right. Yes. So that's going to be on Saturday night, September the 28th, yes. right? Then it continues on Sunday the 29th, and you have entertainment on the stage as well as some other events going on? We do. Uh, that morning, the breakfast will start at 8 a.m., and it'll go until 1 that day just so we can make sure and get everybody the opportunity to come on and get a breakfast. And uh, starting at 8 that morning, we will have live entertainment from John Michael... Um, Thompson. He is um, a wonderful entertainer. He's an autistic child that began to speak through his love of music, and so he's going to be playing with us until around 10. He was here back in the uh, spring for the autism walk, so we're right. very fortunate to have him with us. And we got to have a little of his singing on TV, so if you got to see that, that's the child who will yes. be here, and it yes. was very good. Yeah, very, very good. And then following him, we will have um, um, another local band, which is the Honeysuckle String Band. Mm -hmm. They are 
are, um, they're just a great group of guys that are going to entertain us for a few hours. And after that, we'll have another local band, uh, No DC, uh, Allison Stafford from Bradfordsville. They do a fabulous job and she'll carry on through the um, State Farm Insurance car, truck, and motorcycle show. So we've got a full afternoon, you know, and we're not talking about all of the small activities that happen within these large ones. So um, any kind of, if you'd like a schedule of events or a map, you can go to hamdays.com and that schedule will be updated as those times change or as, you know, we have additions made. Right. So go to hamdays.com, get some more information on all the festivities, or if you'd like to become a part of the festivities, you can do that there too as well. Yes, you can. You can do everything you want online, or, you know, still please pick up the phone call. Don't feel like you can't give us a call. We would love to hear from you. Give us a call at 692-9594, and that's area code 270, and, you know, we'll be happy to send you whatever you like. Yeah, because we're going over 40 years worth of social networking within Marion County with Ham Days. We are. That's unbelievable, isn't it? <laughs> And again, it's going to be September 28th and 29th, right in downtown Lebanon. Go to hamdays.com and find out more. I've been talking with Stacey Mangley with the Marion County Chamber of Commerce. Thank you very much. Thanks.